In this episode of the menu share tutorial series, we're going to be adding an easy share to our menu. Welcome to Mobile Application Tutorials. My name's Nigel. Okay. We've had several tutorials where we've been setting up our application permission-wise and menu-wise. Now we actually get to do a share itself. And it's going to be an easy share from the menu. So we must just get straight started. Okay, okay, we need to go back into our menu file. And that was set up in the previous tutorial. Okay, we need to add one more item here and it's going to be the Action Provider class. And again, it's going to use the app namespace. And it's called the action provider class. And the name for that will be android.support.v7. Careful to put v7 here. And it's a widget. And it's the share action provider is what we need to use to provide the easy share. Okay, that's the only change we need to make there. The rest is going to go into the actual full screen image activity. Yep. Okay, first thing I want to do is I just want to tidy up our um, our image URI here. I need to make that sort of global to the activity itself. And I'll just call it M image URI and then change it down here. And then fix up this these arrows. That's fine because we're going to have to call that from another method inside the activity. Okay, so we need to create a shareable intent which will have the file URI, the type, and everything like that. And then we can provide it to our share action provider. So let's just set up a method to create our um, uh, shareable intent. And it's gonna, I'm going to have it returning an intent here. And I'll just put, let's put create share intent. So inside here, we need, actually need to create intent. Let's call it share intent. Tent. And it's going to be an action send. So the Android system, so once we provide this action to the intent, the Android uh, operating system itself will know that, hang a minute, we want to send something. And it's going to be data that we want to share. In this case, it's going to be an image. Okay, so we're going to need to add a few fields here. So we want to set the type. And this is going to be an image. And I'm going to support all number of images using that star. You could replace the star with JPEG if you wanted to, but just for the sake of it, I want to support a number of images if possible. We also need to add the URI to it as well. To do this, we call put extra, call put extra, and pass in the intent extra string with our image URI there. And then we need to return the uh, share intent as such. Okay, so that's now being done. Now we need to go into the on create options menu and shit set up our share action provider and the first thing we need to do is to get access to our menu item so we need to create a menu item type here this is the menu item that we create in the actual menu and to get that we can call the menu find item then it's r.id 
update of the item which is image share menu. Now we can actually create our shareable action provider. Let's share action provider. And we're going to need to put a bit of a cast in front of here. Not a bit. Okay, and just put a share prov action provider cast in front. Now we need to call the menu item compat because we're using the backwards compatibility here. This has to and get action provider and pass in our menu item. Now once we have our share action provider, we just need to set it with the intent. So call share action provider, set the share intent, and now we can just call our method from down below, create share intent as such. Okay, that's it. That's all we should need to do to um, set up that menu icon for sharing our image. And if we don't, I'm just going to comment this out because we don't, for, sh for the shareable action provider, we don't actually need to enable that on click. That was just set up previously just to support for completeness setting up a menu. So let's try commenting this out just to prove that we don't actually need it for, the, uh, for this particular menu item. And now we'll try running this and see what happens when we try to share. Applications now start. Let's record this so you guys can see what's happening here. Okay, so I'm just going to click on one of the media thumbnails. There we've got the shareable and we've noticed that we've got, I think this is a uh, Facebook Messenger. But if we click on the share icon, it's bringing up a number of areas. I can save it to Google Drive, I can put it onto my messages, save it to Maps, or if we select all, got all these options of how we can share our image to. And that's all I'm going to do for this. So I have shared it to other people's friends. Some of my friends are getting sick of me with my development, so I won't go that far to do that. And there's privacy reasons to support that as well. But that does work. So that concludes this tutorial on how to set up an easy share on your menu. So basically there was just a couple of places we had to work on. We had to add the uh, add, check, add action provider class to our menu, uh, X, menu XML file. And then we also had to set up a shareable image intent create that with the properties of the image and the actual uh, URI to that image as well. And remember from previous tutorials that URI is a shareable, um, it does have shareable permissions. And then it's just a matter of creating our share action provider and just setting up the intent for that share action provider. And that was it. Um, the uh, the um, item will then respond to the click press and provide you with a number of shareable options to send the image to. And if you want to get notified of following tutorial episodes to this tutorial series or any of the other tutorials that I'm working on, you can click on, uh, don't forget to click on the subscribe button. And if you do require help, please don't post any questions to YouTube itself. I just don't have time to even look at them any more. But if you urgently require help, I do provide paid consultancy services. And there's a link to that in my description box as well. Anyway, that's, that's it for this tutorial. Thank you for taking the time to watch and bye for now.